What's up everyone? Um, I'm gonna be doing a vlog today um, about going to play my show. So I'm playing a show with my band The Pumps at Chain Reaction. We actually have a residency there until February 1st. I really need to clean my room right now before I leave. Then I'm gonna start packing my drums up in my car. I'm in the process of cleaning my room, but um, before I play a show, I like to make a checklist of what I need to bring. This is what my checklist looks like. So I sorted some of the things I added on the checklist um, on my bed just to make sure. So I brought a phone charger. These are, this case holds my earplugs. It's my COVID mask. Drumsticks. Bring more than one pair of drumsticks. My stick bag's currently in my car. So I'll add, I'll make sure and do a head count of how many sticks I'm bringing. And then I always bring my practice pad because I always must warm up before my gig, just so I won't hurt myself. And that's really important anyways, regardless. Always warm up before you play a show or even just practice. This is the outfit I'm wearing. We're going for a very Y2K brat stall vibes. Theme is white, hot pink, black, emo vibes, just kind of like MySpace vibes. That's what our band does. We kind of like to coordinate our outfits so we look better on stage, just in general. Another thing I forgot to add on the list was to bring some band-aids because um, sometimes when I play drums, I sweat. I get some gnarly blisters. Just look at my hands. There's a lot of calluses on it, so you just never know. Just make sure you bring some band-aids just in case anything bad happens to your fingers. Hi, Betty. Looks like you're near my drum. I'm gonna bring all my drums in my car and I'm gonna load that in and I'm gonna go to Kevin's house because we are driving together. Say hi to Kylie. Hi. What are you doing? I'm working. On what? Accounting. So fun, right? Yup. Do you wish you could come to the show tonight? Yeah, but I have work. What time? Till five. Darn. I'm preparing myself some avocado toast. Oh my god. I just got to Kevin's house and look who's looking so cute. Alfred! Oh, Alfred got scared. Kevin just threw the keys on the ground. I gotta load up all the stuff in the car. Ah! Everyone, say hi to the cats! What are you guys doing? Yeah, we're just doing some Photoshop shit right now. We're yeah. doing a collab right now. This is Marissa. Hi. Jet, are you going to the show? Yep, going to the show. I'm so excited. Yeah, hell yeah! Oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> this looks sick, by the way. Thank, Thank you. you! Yeah. So we filled this SUV barely cutting it very close with all of our equipment hello what are you doing kevin i am making sure i have absolutely everything i need for my setup i was checking to see if i had my hard drive because everything i need from the set is on my hard drive and it'd be very tragic to forget that oh i bet so yeah make sure before you go to a gig that's far away to always have a checklist because you'll regret it What are you excited the most about, Kevin? Uh, I'm excited for our set. We're working with more components for a set than we've ever really done. We're implementing less vocalists for the first time in a performance, and we're implementing backing track and some other auxiliary stuff and whatnot. Hoping everything works out. I'm very excited for it, but also can't help but be, but to be a little nervous just hoping everything works out the way it's planned. What's your band's name? My band is named Color Mind. We are a prog metal band from San Marcos, California. Hell yeah, check them out. I'll add them in the description below.
extra cane sauce with that, please. Yeah. And I'll be all. And Dr. Pepper, please. Uh, what are you getting? Motherfucking box combo. From where? Motherfucking games. Games.
unfortunately I couldn't really film much of my set and just getting ready. I had to load all this stuff on stage just right after Beerman Brothers set and it was I just could not film myself doing that. Afterwards I was also rushed to get outside the venue because the venue was just like I want to go home and I don't blame them so I had to just load up all my gear back in the car and then I got carried away and talked to some friends and it was really awesome but now I'm just going to put all my gear back inside Kevin's house for now because I don't want to wake up tomorrow morning and do it because I am not a morning person. Also another thing that I, we love when we get back home is just seeing Alfred just always on the couch in this exact spot. Well, at least there's light now. What are we doing? Unloading the gear. The gear. All this good stuff. Those are my laptop. <laughs> crushed too hard. Oh, I hope not. Oh, and look who else it is here. Marty. And we got Jasmine. No. What'd you just do? Jasmine. Did you just meow at me? <laughs> There were some technical difficulties during our set, so during our mid-set, during one of our songs, I forgot what it was, my bass drum just slid forward and just kept sliding and sliding, where the kick pedal just like fell off. And so good thing my friend Cole from Color Mine noticed and he fixed it while I was playing and shout out to him because Without him, I would have just been suffering and there wouldn't have been any kick drums. We're just watching the Instagram stories of what happened. <laughs> My makeup just got so smeared. Sorry, this is gonna be a little graphic, but this is why you should bring band-aids just in case. Because your hands just start to sweat and then when it sweats, it just, your hands just get friction. There's friction between your fingers and then blisters form like this and it's very ugly and gross and sometimes it's very painful but luckily it wasn't painful enough to where I had to stop playing the set so thank the lord all right everyone that about wraps it up today I'm just gonna end tonight by watching American Horror Story and just cuddling with the cats and Kevin it's been a long day but this is much needed Sorry, I'm a little tired, so I might be talking in gibberish. I have to edit out a lot of this stuff because you guys will think I'm stupid. Ah! If you think I should be doing more video vlogs like these, please let me know down in the comments. Thank you everyone for watching today's video vlog. Good night!